In this lesson, we're going to start syncopating the melodies that we're playing with the fingers on top. And a good example of this kind of playing is the music of Mississippi John Hurt. And in particular, there's a tune, Avalon Blues, that he plays in the key of E that you might want to check out. So see if you can hunt that down. And in the meantime, we'll get going on this lesson. In this lesson, we're going to continue with the alternating thumb on an E chord. And we're going to start syncopating the melody notes that we're playing with the fingers. Up until now, we've basically only played quarter notes. So we've matched every bass note with a finger note. Now, in this lesson, we're going to learn how to play on the off beats. So playing with your fingers in between the bass notes. Let's start just with uh, a simple exercise where you've got the thumb going like we've been doing in the previous lesson. And you're going to pinch on the downbeat of the first beat on one. And then immediately afterwards, play the high string again without the thumb. So this is in between bass note one and bass note two. So you'd have pinch and then another finger note and then the thumb would come back in. So at tempo, if you're counting, it would sound like this. One, two, three, four. One, two, three, four. So if you want to think about it <coughs> in theory terms, you're playing eighth notes on top. And if you're counting, instead of just counting one, two, three, four, you're now counting one and two and three and four and. And the second note is falling on the end of one. One and two and three and four and. Once you can do that, um, start with just doing the pinch and the follow note on the end of one and then bring your thumb in to keep the pattern going. And then try to keep the whole measure going once you've done those two notes at the beginning like this. And when you can do that, Let's add in one more syncopated note, or a note, one more note on the offbeat, and this will be after the second thumb note. So we'll have one and two and. So now we're playing on the and of two, as well as the and of one. Pinch and thumb and. One and two and three and four and. Keep the thumb going once you can do that. And when you have that comfortable, then try playing another measure of just the bass after that. So we'd have two full measures that would sound like this. One, two, three, four. One and two and three and four and one, two and three and four and. Once you feel comfortable with that kind of syncopation, then go ahead and try this next tune, which we're going to do. <laughs> 